doesn't like Cornelius on the mic. Rapping 24 hours. What do you mean? <laughs> so he laid a rap on his blind date. I asked him if she kisses like me, and he said, who? Meanwhile, Caroline had a blind date, too. He has the most beautiful dimples. And made him smile with her freestyle. She asked me, what do you think about it when I stand? Now, will they find the time to continue to rhyme? Or have a change of heart? Thank you very much, I'm Chris Jagger. Welcome to Change of Heart. Let's meet our couple. Now, he's a former Marine from South Carolina. She's an old-fashioned girl from the Virgin Islands. They met five months ago, and once he got wind of her accent, he just had to meet her. Now he's afraid she's all talk, and he wants more action. Please welcome Caroline Harry and Cornelius Wedman. Welcome to the show. Now, Cornelius, if you've got some doubts about Caroline, why do you stay with her? Well, she's a really sweet girl, you know, and I think that maybe if I stay with her, we might make something happen. You, okay, you're so kind of confident about that. Now, Cornelius, as far as the partnership goes, how equal is it? Well, she's totally dependent on me. I mean, I'm thinking that the first no, of the year, I can claim all no, my I'm taxes. Not. I spent so much money. No, you know? I'm not. <laughs> how much money you know, he took I me mean, to Wendy's for I'm dinner? I'm always taking oh, it out. Oh, here, oh, Wendy's. Uh -uh, uh -uh. I mean, uh -uh. That's what where she wanted to go, but I, I've cooked oh for her, I've took her out, I've done everything. She one just... dinner, one dinner. Let's get Caroline's side of this because uh, he's complaining that he makes all the effort. Caroline, what's your biggest complaint? Chris, he is so boring. <laughs> boring. Oh my gosh, he is Romantic so Romantic walks on the boring. beach, candlelights, different things like that. What y'all think? I want him that to be spontaneous. But well, tell get me why he's boring. On. He doesn't do anything. Cook dinner, watch TV. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's Chris, so she's okay. So all she do is sit dance. around and read books all day. She's 29 years old and go over to her best friend's house and spend it night like a slumber party. Not seven days a week. I mean, you're 29 days years old, girl. No, I don't. That is what you would call boring. You know, I'm... I'm on the grind. All right, now, Cornelius, what makes you think that you guys may not be compatible then? Well, because she always using these different excuses, saying she's from the islands when it's convenient for her, mm -hmm. when I try to tell her what it's like to be in California or whatnot. But when it's, when it's something she don't understand, she use dumb excuses like it's to her advantage. You know, I'm All not right. from the islands. You know, so I, she's trying to play that to right, her advantage. Right, contradicting yourself be one way. No, I'm not. Now, Caroline, do you think you use that as an excuse? No, I don't. Chris, I've only been up here for a year. Uh, I don't have a car. Now it's only... I don't have now a car. He only, wants me to like me. Oh, but if it's something that she, I tell her she don't know about, well, don't act like I don't know what's going on here. I mean, just be one way. Either you don't or you do. If you don't, listen to me. It's always <laughs> yeah, to be his guy. way. He, Chris, he always tells me what to do. I can never have my own opinion. Mm -hmm. Always his way. Well, Maybe Carolyn, you uh, since you guys come from different backgrounds, <laughs> what's, what's the connection <laughs> that you find with him? He's, he's very sweet. He's very romantic. Oh. Yeah, he's... You know, he makes me feel really good. I love his body. Mm -hmm. You know, he has a six pack. <laughs> and he massages really, really good. So. All right. So he's in good shape and yes. he's uh, very he's sexy. Got now, me, got now me. Cornelius, I want you to fill in the blank here. Caroline is a sexy ass. Finish it. My grandma. I mean, I got to say. <laughs> She won't let me touch her. We haven't had sex. She don't really want to let me kiss her like that. Well, actually, she can't really kiss that. Oh, oh my gosh. If you would not stop suffocating me oh, so girl, much, I would know. be able to I kiss can, you really good. You're just old fashioned. I get creative with mine, you know. No, you like, don't. No, you don't. What's he get all over you too much? Yes, he, the sloppiness. No, I don't like that. <laughs> Baby, you know, it just, you know, I'm just not basic. I'm sorry, I'm just not basic. Now, Caroline, how often do you and Cornelius just kind of like hang out, talk, do a little bit of that? We never do. Rapping, 24 hours Wait, a day. Wait, he's rapping? Yes. Like a Seven rapper? Seven days a week. Chris, what? we're in the car. <laughs> Chris. Come on. Chris, that's what we I do. We never get to talk. That's what I do, Chris, and I can include you in it, but that's Chris, just a goal I'm does. trying to... I, I am like here, and his rapping Chris, is like Chris, she, she don't never call me. I got to... I got to pay her. She pays me because it's free, you know. But mm -hmm. other than that, you know, she don't call me talk. What you mean? Yeah, but I you got to talk to her, not just rap to her all well, the time. Caroline, yeah. why did you want to come on the show? Because we haven't had any sex. And I want to make sure when we go all the way that, you know, we, it's the right time. And I don't want to. I want to make sure he's the perfect guy for me. And that I he's the right one. Yeah, oh. he's the 
Now, Cornelia, she says, and she admits she's holding back. What's your take on coming here today? Well, I've been holding back also, and I just want to open up to it and just maybe give more. Just try to wait it out and, you know, maybe see what happens. All right, that's what we're going to do here. Now, Caroline doesn't let Cornelius get too physical, but Cornelius' date let him touch her all over. We're going to meet her next, so stay tuned. He told us that he wanted a modern woman who'd be more affectionate with him, but less dependent on him. So we hooked him up with a former Marine who's trained in survival tactics, but always knows how to make night maneuvers on her man. Please welcome Shay Ashford. <laughs> Does Shay look like you expected her being a Marine and everything? He doesn't need another Marine. I mean, he's a tough guy. I mean, he needs somebody as soft as me to keep his heart. Oh. Oh. Now, Shay, what about you? You talked to him on the phone. Any signs right away that you and Cornelius were going to hit it off? Yes, Chris. As soon as he called me, we had a lot in common. We went to boot camp to the same place. We had a lot of same duty stations, and we went to the same school together. So common. things were clicking right away. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, Shay, you felt that connection. What about any concerns that might have come up? Well, Chris, to be honest with you, any guy that calls me 10 times in two days... You do oh. what? Romantic, you call her romantic. 10 times? I, I was mean, a little concerned. I was just trying to get you some attention, you You never call me 10 you know? times in a day. <laughs> you, and we, obviously, you won't never call me 10 times in a day. Dude. I call you more than, t more than five times for sure, but so, you called her 10 times? Well, can I... He I said was he was just trying, trying to get, get all attention. the information I could, you know. 10 what, times? I'm just trying to get out of you. He's a little slow, I guess. Now, Cornelius, what about when you finally met? Were you happy with the way she looked? Oh, uh, yeah, she Y2K compatible. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> she had it going on. She, she had the nice skirt on. She had the hair and nails done. She, we just click and clank, you know? Clank. So you was all good? Now, what about her style compared to Caroline's? Platinum and gold. You know, she was... She was uh, she wasn't, she wasn't old-fashioned. She was, like, hip with me. She was running. I didn't have to carry her with me. You know, we was, like... Clinking. So you're saying a little step above compared yeah. to yes, the two. Yes, sir. All right, now, Shay, well, what, what's your dating life been like lately? Well, can you say drought? <laughs> I haven't been on a date in six months. Guys are just so into themselves, into their cars. It was nice to go out with a guy. It made me feel special. So he broke the dry spell. That was nice. Yes. Now, Cornelius, how did you kick off the date with Shay? Well, I, I wanted to go see the sunset because that's how I do it, you know. You but, did that with me? No, with her. I'm saying me and her. I wanted her, me and her to go see the sunset, but she, um, she never made it on time. That was one bad thing. Well, she, what was the problem there? She's a little slow. A little late. What about Caroline? Is she you good about being on time? The she can't be anywhere. I mean, she has no way to get to me. Well, that's right. She has no wheels. Right. That's, yeah. Mm -hmm. But that's fine. Now, Shay, uh, what about the fact that when you're hanging out with Cornelius, was there anything that was obvious that he's having problems with Caroline? Can you say starred for attention? Oh. As soon as he saw me, he hugged me. He held my hand the whole time. He wouldn't let me go. She gives him no play. Really? So you felt right away that was really? it. Really? Yes. Hmm? yes. Oh. Now, Cornelius, what about the differences between a date with Shay versus a date with Caroline? What was the uh, big difference? Well, Shay was like more on my level. Me and her, we just clicked, touchy feeling, different things. She didn't complain Broken. as much as Carolyn complains. So you love to grope. Oh, you don't like when he gropes on no, you? No, he gropes my butt in public, and I don't like it. He always touched my butt in public. Bro, we what? in a new, <laughs> we in a new millennium, girl. I mean, so not in front you better of everybody. wise up. <laughs> Come on, you don't do that. Wise up. Now, Shay, one of the things that Caroline said is Cornelius is always doing is rapping. Did you get to hear any? Oh, yeah. It was very romantic. Oh, we went on the oh, you beach. Rapped to her? We did you a makeshift video and oh, rapped, rapped to me. Oh, I rapped too much for you. And right? it was all about <laughs> Not one made for me. You made one for her, not for me. So you're saying you don't get anything special. You just have to hear all his regular yep, rapping. Yeah, regular blah, 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 mm -hmm. blah. <laughs> okay. Now, Cornelius, what about the romance department? You and Shay, your guys are hanging out at the beach and stuff. How, how romantic did it get? Well, we, um, we were sitting out there on the beach. The atmosphere was right, so I um, massaged her back. From my back to her toes. Right. You do that to yeah, everybody? She, and then I... Uh, <laughs> because, I mean, he massages me too. Uh-huh, but it wasn't on the beach. And then she had on a nice skirt. Yeah. So I told her to turn over, you know. Oh, you did. Uh, 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 so do I ask what happens next there, Cornelius? Uh, oh, you did. 
I kind of had some chopped up fruit, you know, cantaloupes and watermelon and kind of like rubbed it on the lips and fed it to her and See, kissed her a little he bit. He never does anything like that for you me. You gotta deserve that type stuff. You gotta deserve it. Really? <laughs> Gotta work it out, you know. All right, Cornelius, I'm I'm assuming that you're getting kind of excited about everything that's going on here, right? Uh, yeah, I was getting very excited. It was nice. It was a real nice date. Mm -hmm. Shay, you kind of answer questions with a question sometimes. I noticed that. Did Cornelius ever do that to you? Well, actually, yes. This one time we were kissing and messing around, and uh, I asked I asked him if she kisses like me, and he said, "Who?" <laughs> oh! You did. Huh? Huh? <laughs> Caroline, can you imagine this guy would actually forget about you on the date? Oh, I can just imagine. <laughs> now, Shay, did you feel that you had his attention 100%? Well, actually, no. I was kind of trying to talk about Miss Thane because she doesn't have a car and she dresses like a grandma. But then he was like, oh. he but said, you're don't single. talk but about I was her. single, like, I would be having can, a million so. dates and you don't. Oh. Come on now. Oh. But, but Carol, he, well, he's, he's kind of sticking up for you a little bit. Yeah, I took up for you, girl. Yeah, oh, you see? You kissed her, and you massaging her back, and right. putting the thing in her <laughs> mouth, and you were thinking about me? I said I took up for you. Uh, yeah, he did a little bit. He's going to get some credit. Now, Cornelius, give us a quick comparison between Shay and Caroline. Well, Carolyn was, you know, she complains, like, so much, you know, and but, but she's really sweet. But her, we, we just, we had a lot in common, you know, military background, we just kind of clean, mm -hmm. you know. Now, Shay, uh, Cornelius promised you the most romantic date ever. Tell us if he delivered. Can you say Cinderella from the moment? <laughs> the flowers, the dinner, the candlelight, You give the her beach. flowers? You never give me no flowers. <laughs> you gotta work on stuff like that. <laughs> It was like, just like Cinderella, and he was a prince. Tonight. And there you are, Prince Cornelius. Thank you very much. <laughs> Next up, though, we're going to meet Caroline's date and find out why he says that he touched her in places that Cornelius only dreams about. <laughs> Stay tuned. his date with Shay, and now we're going to meet the guy that Caroline dated. Now, she was looking for a guy who preferred talking over rapping and a night out of the town uh, over sitting at home. So we found her a personal trainer who says he's all talk and even more action. Please welcome Sean Rael. Does this guy look like stiff competition for you? On a scale of 1 to 10, I'm a 12. He ain't even rated. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> he ain't even rated, dog. Okay, Sean, what about you? Your first impression when you met Caroline? Well, it was sort of dark, and she had a leather jacket on. I really couldn't see how she looked, but as I hugged her, she looked very cute. Her accent was beautiful. I she know, smelled right? delicious. Yeah, very beautiful. <laughs> I hear it all the time. <laughs> and Caroline, what about you through the darkness? What is it that you noticed about Sean? Chris. Oh my God, he has the most beautiful dimples <laughs> and his face. Oh my God. I got them. <laughs> <laughs> so you like that? Uh, yes, I did. Now, Sean, it sounds like obviously there's some sparks there physically. What about intellectually once you started to uh, get to know her? Well, she's very smart. We had a great intellectual conversation at dinner time, but that might be hard to figure out if all you talk about is rapping. <laughs> wow. But, uh, <laughs> Great time. We talked about the military, about world events. And oh, you want to talk time. about the military? I'm <laughs> glad we out. You talk about the military. Now, Caroline, you say Cornelius is sometimes kind of boring. What about a dinner with Sean? Anything unpredictable? Chris, oh my God, I'm coming out from the restroom. Oh, your God. <laughs> and the waiter is—he has this big, big, huge bouquet of roses. He walks up to me and tell me, "This is for you." <laughs> And that's so sweet. So you, he had the waiter actually bring you and deliver you flowers? Yes. I mean, that's spontaneous. That, that's being, crea I mean, being creative about it. Totally unexpected. Yes. And Sean, why did you have them delivered to the table? Well, she sort of asked me to bring them uh, on the phone. I really wasn't too happy about that. But, but she didn't bring a person. <laughs> Wait, so she important. was like demanding that you bring her flowers? Right, right. So I wanted to do something to surprise her, so I had the way to bring them over. All right, well, Caroline, you got what you asked for, at least. What about anything else that you wanted? Yes, I asked him to walk down with me on Shoreline, hand in hand, you know, talking, which we did. Aww. Now, Cornelius, that sounds like something that's simple and romantic. Simple is very much It was that simple. <laughs> uh, Caroline, did you enjoy that moment, walking along the Shoreline, hand in hand? No, it was kind of rude of him. He was always walking way ahead in front of me. Oh. It was kind of rude. 
Well, Sean, what was that about? How are you going to be, you know, maintain any kind of conversation? Well, I mean, we we were trying to keep a good pace. It was kind of cold, so we just walked to the shoreline. He but, thought he was uh, in boot camp. Or something. <laughs> <laughs> he done left my girl. Sean, anything else though yeah, that interrupted the conversation? <laughs> well, actually, we were on the shoreline, and uh, there were couples on the bench, like having sex. Oh, hello. Exactly. <laughs> so, I, I know that, that, I know she right. flipped they, out by that one, boy. <laughs> <laughs> so it kind of uh, interrupted us, our conversation. Now, what about now? We know Caroline's a little old-fashioned. Did Very. she get turned on or turned off by this? Well, she obviously didn't get turned off. We started kissing at that oh! point. <laughs> And Caroline, what was that kiss like? It was a long, passionate kiss. Oh, we, we just kissing now. And it wasn't all big and sloppy like you have. Oh no, it was nothing like Cornelius Stone. I'll stop. Yeah. 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 Yeah, right. yeah. Yeah, but Cornelius, I gotta make one other point though. She was busting on you about having a kiss on your date, and now there she was. Right, but ask my date how I kiss. You don't do that. Oh, how do you kiss? It was very passionate. Right. Yeah. 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 All right, Caroline, hey, yeah. what about you though? Compare the two di- the kisses between the two guys. I prefer Sean. Sean okay. Now, Sean, Cornelius complains that Caroline holds back on her. Did you feel that? Did she hold back with you? Not at all. At that point, we actually, we started kissing and uh, she put her hands just inside my jacket. Mm-hmm. And I did the same like that well, too. Well, was, I was outside, she was, you know, hands obviously cold. Well, actually, she wanted to see <laughs> how my body felt. Yeah, and Sean, how did you think about her body? Oh, it was great. And she actually passed the butt test. Oh, uh, which is, <laughs> what's your butt test? Exactly, it's nice and firm. And, oh, is that and right? she said I passed hers too. Yeah, because I touched his butt too, right. and oh my I God. See. Oh. She said it was kind of saggy. Contradictory. Like she just told me she don't like her butt being touched. Now you touching other he people's butt. A, he did it right. in a good way. You groped me. Right. He did Whoa, not. Girl, what you want me to do? Touch me? <laughs> <laughs> Sean, I want to feel it. <laughs> Sean, at this point, did she say anything that surprised you? Actually, she did. Uh, we sat down on the bench, and she sat just in my lap. She was just perfect. And uh, we started kissing and talking, and she stopped, and she looked me in the eye, and she asked me, what do you think about a one-night stand? I was, I was just joking. <laughs> <laughs> right now, my dad. Yeah, I'm freaking the house. Was, yeah, wait, was, that, was that what was on your no, mind? No, I just thought about it for a second. I, I just did. I just did. Been with me I for know, months, huh? <laughs> right. Boy. I know I can talk to him. I can joke love, with him sexually right. about it. Right. Corne- exactly. Cornelius can't. All he wanted was, was grow, It was just grow, a joke. Just oh, like yeah, it was just a joke. Yeah, innocent yeah. little oh, joke. Oh, yeah. nah, I'm matching with yeah. mine, though. You know what I'm oh, saying? Okay. I ain't got three different colors on. And- oh. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You heard? Taylor made and all, you heard? All right, Caroline, what about by the end of the night? (laughs) What about by the end of the night? Did Sean do any groping of his own? No, no, he he did not. It was an old fashioned kiss. Good night. Old fashioned, like, you know. So he was a gentleman to the end. And Caroline, since your date, who have you been thinking about? Well, I've been thinking about Cornelius no because doubt. it reminded me of our first date together. Aww. So he's been on your mind. All right, well, next it's time for the good old fashioned conclusion, and we're going to find out what happens when we come back, so stay tuned. <laughs> see if they're ready to take their relationship to the next level. We want to know, did the show give them sexual feelings for their dates or sexual healing for their relationship? Let's find out. Cornelius, we're going to get your decision first. You guys have been hanging out for five months now. It's a a little stretch of time, but we sent you out with Shay. You guys had a romantic evening. You gave her a nice massage. You gave her some kissing. What do you say? Shay, she's very compatible, so I decided to have a change of heart. Change of heart? Don't waste any time there. Shay, does that work for you? Well, actually, Chris, this show has shown me that he's got, he doesn't have enough time for me. He's with his rap and all, and I need more attention. Oh, really? Oh. So you're turning him down. Cornelius, I'm sorry that didn't work out the way you had hoped. All right, Caroline, let's get your decision now. You said you've been trying to make things work. Things weren't always exactly the way you wanted them to be. You went out with Sean. You guys had a good time. It was kind of exciting. Some things that you've been missing with Cornelius. You had some kissing yourself. What do you say? Well, I'm really comfortable around Cornelius. But Sean, on the other hand, he knows how to treat a lady really good. So I had a change of heart. Change of heart. Uh, Sean, you all right with that? I'm great with that. He's great with that. There you go. All right. 
it's probably a good thing that you guys came on to the show and didn't go to the next level before this happened, and now you guys can start some new relationships. And Cornelius, I know you're going to find somebody oh, that's man, expert I'm for you. It, dog. Excellent. All right. Good luck, man. That's our show for today. Thanks to Cornelius and Shay, and good luck to Caroline and Sean, and we'll see you next time right here on Change of Heart. Thank <laughs> you.